Hi, this is Mark Wiltshire. Thanks for joining us for this Uritaya Tarena interview with Mohammed Almarani from Mokka Market. Mohammed, thanks for joining. Thank you. Well, uh, I I came. I was raised in a, in and was born in a village in a mountain a mountainous village, and it's uh, known for people being uh, uh, or la being uh, interested in in business and uh, they do their own work. There there is there are no no companies and uh, basically they just buy and sell stuff. And I I had that that kind of. Uh, uh, interest and uh, I uh, after that we moved to the uh, c capital city of, of Yemen uh, <coughs> where I uh, I continued my study and I uh, after I finished the high school I studied in uh, commercial uh, like uh, pilot aviation uh, where I studied in in Jordan and I got the uh, license and uh, the certificates uh, and after that, I applied for work in the uh, and worked in in the Yemen Airways for uh, uh, some some time. Uh, then uh, I I decided to move to Finland after the war started uh, in Yemen. Uh, and uh, my main goal was to uh, uh, study and con continue my studies. Uh, and get the uh, higher uh, certificates and uh, degrees where I like I chose fin <coughs> Finland to uh, to study and continue my uh, like this st uh, my studies and uh, uh, improving myself from the educa educational sides and Finland is known uh, for for this kind uh, for this uh, this field in this field in general uh, and uh, I, I came to Finland and I ended up here like making my, uh, my journey and starting my journey here in Finland. So as I mentioned before that uh, I have grown in a family or in an environment where most of uh, like the uh, relatives are interested and uh, almost everyone has his own own thing to do like or to or to work on privately uh, and i got also i inherited that and uh, uh, since i was there I, I used to help my brother i used to help my my father in in their businesses and their their work <coughs> and i i wanted i am i have been interested since the, i came here to open and uh, to start my own business uh, in, in Finland and uh, uh, since I also learned and knew that uh, the environment is supporting to, uh, to start a business and it's not really complicated and really uh, uh, let's say difficult to, uh, to start a new business. So you saw as someone who <coughs> moved here uh, you saw entrepreneurship as a kind of quite easy way for you to start earning your living. A easy way, and it is like a goal since the beginning. Although I am, I, I, and I have mentioned also this before that even my career is a commercial pilot, but it doesn't mean I cannot be uh, an entrepreneur. entrepreneur. Uh, uh, it's even like studying this, uh, like aviation. Uh, it's it was all the idea of having or building uh, my, my business was there and maybe it could be part of the the plan itself and maybe it still could be one day yeah it is true yeah still my family are, are helping me Almost uh, whenever I need uh, th I need anything there. Uh, uh, for example, when I get stuff and or when I get, uh, need somebody like urgently uh, to take care of the shop. Uh, <coughs> but I also get other advice and help, uh, like uh, support support from uh, from friends and uh, from some organizations like uh, Wise. Uh, they 
sometimes they offer me advices and we meet from uh, we have meetings from uh, time to time uh, and I also buy stuff from local suppliers in Finland and from outside and this this uh, products or <coughs> uh, the deliveries come on time and they, that makes makes our work uh, easier. Uh, it's it's been challenging uh, since the big, uh, when we started the first shop at the beginning, when the corona came and it was difficult to bring all the all the stuff we needed to bring back then, and also the uh, the uh, differences of the prices uh, price uh, from place to place. Uh, but having the new shop also it's uh, it's it was uh, it's also from our vision of improving and uh, we wanted also to, uh, like since the beginning to improve and to get uh, to get more people to know the, that we uh, exist this uh, this uh, the concept of this shop is not re really different from the other one but the speciality is the, the difference I mean the speciality for our shop in general this one and the one in, in the center we offer uh, new stuff and daily needed uh, products from for uh, for uh, peoples from different backgrounds and we want uh, new people to try our products and to uh, to know that we have these products and that they can get them easily and this new shop is in Idia Park in Seinioki so how is how is that helping you to find new customers what's the benefit of being here uh, uh, of course, because since people are uh, come here uh, of, uh, more and they come uh, more often, uh, there are uh, the Idea Park has uh, a, sell, a collection of many brands and uh, shops, and uh, this this would be completing this this uh, selection and this collection. We we would be or we want to be a part of this. Uh, nice and uh, versatile coll uh, collection. And um, is it bringing you different types of customers? Is that what you're experiencing? Yeah, we uh, until now we we uh, we found that we uh, we are getting new customers and uh, different types of people and more customers are coming in, which is the things we were aiming for. First of all, uh, our main goal and our main target is that to keep the, our customers satisfactory. We are happy when we get our customers happy. Uh, and we, want, we are now focusing on improving ourselves here in the local area. But uh, I also dream uh, to bring the, uh, the coffee with, uh, from my country, Yemen which is known for growing uh, a very high quality coffee which uh, grown in mountain uh, mountains uh, and uh, uh, they uh, and uh, they are harvested by hand and uh, it has its uh, origin authentic and uh, special flavors and I want to sell this coffee here in Finland and make people <coughs> Finnish people know uh, this or taste this uh, uh, special and uh, diff or special flavor coffee. So really building on the mocha yeah, name which is in, the, in yeah. the company. Mm. Yeah. Which is like the main idea of, of making the name of the coffee. And what about yeah. growing the business into the, into the future as well? We, ha we have also hopes and dreams also and plans to make our uh, shop bigger. It could be in somewhere else or it could be here in San Diego. That's great. Mohamed Almarani from Mokka Market, thank you very much for joining us today, sharing some of your story that's already happened and some of your story maybe still to come.